Ready? Ready. Okay. So, John, I'm gonna make this quick because I got this. I can only send you like maybe 30 seconds of, of training time on these videos. So, the number one thing you really want to do that you want to make sure of is that you don't tense up here. You want to. You got to remember. Well, with your leg being messed up, you want to relax from the waist up. Right? Your shoulders have to sit in the pocket and you want to lift your elbow up. Everything comes from here, right? So you want to lift the elbow up. I'm going to do it straight at you and then I'm going to do it to the side. As you're launching this out, you want to push the elbow all the way out to where the elbow snaps, right? To where it locks, right up the center. My wrist is always in my center, so when I hit, I'm hitting with knuckle only and not fingers. The further over my wrist is away from my center, the more I'm hitting with fingers. I'm going to knuckle. So as I push out, the elbow goes straight out. As I push out again, it locks. 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 So as I'm pushing forward, I'm launching this out. But I want you to notice, John, that as I'm punching, here's the triangle. Here's the triangle shape right here. There's the wedge off. Here's the wedge off. So that you got, here's the wedge here. And the wedge is here. So as I'm punching, shooting the elbows up and out. And the faster I go, the more I tense up my weight, my thighs, so that my body doesn't bounce. All right? So as I'm punching, I relax. So I shoot it out. All right? But here from the side, and then you come over here. Come over. So standing, so you can see it from the side. Right here. So as I'm punching from the side, the elbow lifts up. Then it drops. It doesn't pull, but I'm pulling my elbow back. Because now, if I just hit somebody, I just gave them the distance that I just hit them. That's why you want to pull the elbow back. And as long as you drop the elbow right towards the center, and the palm comes back. See? The elbow stops right here at the rib cage, and my forearm snaps back so it can align with my elbow. Mm -hmm. When my shoulders don't come up, every time my shoulders come up, now I'm hitting with muscle versus hitting from a relaxed state with tendons and joints. Okay, and because they stretch, it's like a thing being snapped with a rubber band. Somebody holds an end of a rubber band and they catch it. It hurts. Why? Because the tension from the rubber band snaps beyond the point of where you are. It just runs into you. Same thing with the joints and tendons. So when my shoulders down and relax, I shoot this out. And my arms have to stay down and relax. So if I shift off, I'm still punching from my body. So they don't lift up, they don't turn, they stay down. And I punch directly from my body with both sides. Right, John? Now, comes the other part, over there. Let me stop this one. Yeah. Stop that video.